Mask, 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 mask. Mask, mask. Mask, mask. Hey, hey. Hey, what's going on here? Not sure. It's something beautiful. I hear there's a lot of mirrors. Ooh. Chattering money. We're hanging out. Little girl wants to be <laughs> Eventually, their patience ran out. They felt that Iran had been stringing them along. So, the EU countries, particularly France, Germany, Britain, uh, who've been doing the negotiating, are now very much with the US in wanting to see increased pressure on Iran, and they're happy to go along the sanctions route. Of course, Russia and China, with very strong commercial interests in Iran, Russia, for example, having built uh, a nuclear power station in Iran, uh, they don't want to go down that particular route. Uh, and so we're seeing Vladimir Putin say, let's keep this in the International Atomic Energy Agency rather than in the Security Council. We've got the Chinese saying, oh, no, let's have lots more diplomacy before we get down to the hard stuff. Iranian food is the best, just stay away from the kebabs. <laughs> This box, you can find them all over Iran. It's for charity. This is how they do it. They just put these boxes anywhere on each street corner. And uh, people just put change in them. It's great. You know, I guess this shows us that everybody can fall into this trap. But what this does do, and this has a lot to do with the culture, uh, and it has to do a lot with one, an aspect of political Islam, or Islamism, as it's sometimes referred to, and that is community responsibility, sharing the guilt, that kind of thing. Here we are. We're at the tomb of Daniel, and this is something that happened in the Bible. Something, you know, like Bible. Well, check it out. There's a good friend Maggie Better singing. In the uh, sky, I don't think that's a good idea. As we have cold weather, it goes down, uh -huh. and hot weather or warm weather, it goes up. So we have a wind tower. The wind comes like a cooler inside the Iranian house and here for this palace. So we go and see the palace and I, I show you the air condition system for Iranian. Iranian business. Oh, Uh, that's cool, we don't need them. Oh wait, say it again on film. 
they are serious about their hijab. So please ask them for permission when you want to make a movie from Iranian women with chador. You can literally be arrested on the spot if you're not asking permission. It's not pretty. If they say yes, you can do this. But if they say no, please, no movie from Iranian women with chador. I started to raise my camera a little bit and the looks I got, man, it was not pretty. Yes, I am in the Shiraz Wax Museum, and all these statues behind me are made out of wax. 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 She's not moving. She's made out of wax. <laughs> Say wax. Can you see the mirrors? This is a jaw dropper. One of them not very important in Iran, but they did it for the people and very, very important for Iranian. They respect to these places. But the differences between... ...has actually uh, succeeded in getting the leadership agreeing to this Russian compromise proposal I had just outlined. And uh, I think the rest has to think who we want to strengthen there, the more moderates or the more aggressive ones. But currently, uh, he, uh, Ahmadinejad is holding the upper hand. Where do you see the crisis heading? There are two possibilities. Number one, there is an agreement uh, by the West on this compromise uh, proposal, and then we might have a political solution, which would be face-saving for Iranian, but would secure that they could never develop nuclear weapons, not even uh, produce nuclear energy. Or in a few weeks, uh, the Bush administration will declare the UN of having failed again, not taking up its responsibility, like before Iraq. And then Washington will go it along with a coalition of the willing. And, and I know that, uh, well, actually, I've been really lucky. I'm very proud of everybody. And I'm proud of all of my groups that I've ever brought here over the past 10 years. But there have been times when I felt, many times, actually, where I felt that I had failed in not being a bit more uh, uh, forthcoming or more, I don't know, more direct. America. These kids are crazy. I've never seen such a group of Neanderthals. What are they doing? They're chasing me. It's totally mass hysteria over here. I just don't know what's going on. Oh, here's a friend. Let me check. A good friend. In my yesterday. Oh, my good friend. We we'll shake hands. Very good. Very good. It was great, but then the sun disappeared. So now, now I'm realizing that uh, my the trip I meant to go on didn't really happen, but it kind of did. It's one of those like faint glimmers, glimmers of reality.